Working on the weekend like usual. Way off in the deep end like usual. Niggas swear they passed us, they doing We're going nail shopping. Yeah, so I'm hitting up the nail supply store because one of my local nail supplies is like going out of business. And so he's having like a 40% off. What? Yeah, he's having like a 40% off. And so I'm getting ready to go meet my home girl. And we're gonna go get some stuff, okay? It's very early, muggy, very ugly looking Sunday morning. And But it's so beautiful. Oh my God, oh my God. Oh my God. Let, me, let me show you guys this. Let me show you guys. No matter what you say or what you do When I'm alone I'd rather be with you Fuck these other niggas I'll be right back inside Till 2005 Okay, oh, wow. no, wait a minute All good just a week ago At my house We party every weekend So yeah. on the radio so I, I'm telling y'all Like I just love when the trees are like You know Changing colors And it's like fall time And it's fall season Because like Fall is like my favorite season, okay? Period. And I'm just gonna blog this. Um, and we're just gonna go and have a good time. I do got stinky booty with me in the back. I'm over here looking a little mad. Like, boy, cut it out. Say hi, stink. Hi, booty, 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 booty. Are you smiling now? Stinker. Booty, Mr. Mr. Amazing. Gotcha. I'm definitely going to stop at like, first of all, I just realized I didn't turn my heat off. It was probably loud as heck over all my voice. But it's cold. It's cold. It is 57 degrees. So, yeah, we're going to stop and get some little easy eats before we dip out and then to the store. We gotta go spend some money. One of the things that I kind of like need from the nail supply store is like I need some nail files. Um, I'm going to stock up on buffers. You know, I already have them. And some lint free wipes. I can't stand cotton. Um, and uh, I want to get though like a new nail brush. Hopefully they have and like maybe a, um, if they have like a, what's it called? A stand so I can like record and stuff, my YouTube videos and things like that. I need to stand. And then of course I'll probably get some top coat and I have plenty of gel polish. So I really don't need no more gel polish. But I'll get some top coats. Maybe get some cover powders and some monomer. Like I'm praying to God that they have some young nails monomer or just some monomer I can work with. Because I have Mia secret right now. And y'all know. <laughs> the smell is like wild and I've been using it and I've been using it to practice because when I ordered like a lot of it, low key, I had like two big bottles and I was like, okay, let me just use this and get rid of it. And I know a lot of people do like me a secret, don't get me wrong. I like it. I know how to work with it, uh, but it's very beginner, you know, and that smell is wicked. So it, it's time for me to upgrade and I deserve to get something better. Like I don't have to be using this just because it's what I have you know what I'm saying like I might even give a bottle away because I'm just like because they even got the odorless drops and stuff it does help I'm gonna lie it does help it helps but I just want something new and ain't nothing wrong with that I want something new that new new okay new new booty on duty but we're gonna see what they have and that's really all I want overall. Maybe I'll get a couple charms. I don't use a lot of charms. I'm not into the charm game like that. Don't come for me. Don't come for me. So, on the 
Thank you. You too. Have song. a great day. I don't know, like, I don't feel like I'm the Got no patience. I'm not a doctor. Good old mama. Oh, that looks like it says mom here. Tell me it doesn't. Can you go with Stinky? Hey, good. And I just got the chicken wrap sandwich. It was like number five on the menu. I don't know. But. And some iced coffee. I think I'm going to wear out no coffee. I could have definitely went to like Starbucks or something. But I thought it was breakfast time, y'all. It is 11.32. Why did I think it was still breakfast? Did I not check the time? I just thought because I woke up today that it was. Oh, hold on, y'all. My homegirl calling me. Hello? So I just pulled up. This one's open. And it's supposed to be, but this one's open. And he's not answering his phone, girl. You got I'm his here. personal number, too? No, there's a phone number on the door. <laughs> oh, does the sign on the door say they're supposed to be open today? Is it like? Yes, it says Sunday, 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. And online it says open. There's another girl in another here right now. They always do this dumb shit. Like, this is why you can't keep notes because you don't be open. <laughs> I don't know. Like, oh no sense. My allergies are terrible. Do y'all hear my congestion? When I say the season changed, so did my nose. That's crazy, y'all. Well, I'm gonna enjoy my little chicken wrap, is it, y'all? And I'm gonna see y'all when I get there and we pull up on my homegirl, me. I can't tell. Just when I'm chest cleared and not here, cause they don't care. I'm sad, but I'm laughing. Whatever happens, assassins are stabbed in the back of my cabin. Labrador yapping. I'm glad that it happened. I mean, it between us, I think there's something special. Here, bro. <laughs> to get back over here. Like, who's not trying to pay for Mimi's in the car, y'all. Okay, YouTube won't monetize yeah. me if there's cussing, so. Oh, my bad. I'll put it down too so you can. There's Mimi, you guys. The one that was on the phone cussing. Her. Going on. Her. <laughs> <laughs> now my clock's six minutes fast, but it's you don't get y'all get to just eleven fifty four versus we supposed to be open up at ten. And shouldn't you be here in here cleaning out? I should get a black nail powder while I'm in here because I don't have black and I want to do some black nails. Black, black, black. I didn't realize how much people wow. use black. That's why I started doing nails. Girl, them black girls. I love black on my nails. I'm black nails. I don't like the gel polish in black. Like, I just want, like, the acrylic. You feel like it's harder to work with that polish? Look at my window freaking well, It just cracks. depends on what you want to do. Like, oh, God. I just got this new window last year mm -mm, in Cali, and I was crapped. I'm like, you drove your car up here? I shipped it. Ooh, it cost my hundred dollars. I bet it is. Ugh. I don't want to talk about that part of my life. I feel like I'm traumatized. No. <laughs> For enough time to jot your thoughts, but fuck it, this morning I got to. I'm thinking about you. I heard you just had your another little baby. Congratulations. I hope you got through it with no complications. I find it amazing the way that you juggle your kids. The fame, the bitches that's hating They sit around waiting For you to fall off like the album I'm making But I hope that you take in A little time for yourself Still in a moment or two to unwind Between the hectic sound Oh, they got not polish in here Yep <laughs> You're on your own I wrote this for you to put on Thank you for sharing your light, your voice And writing a beautiful poem Session 32, bring me to tears Be getting choked up when I hear it Seems like I keep crying off so much Since a nigga had these kids And I don't know what it is That made me so sensitive More than I, I already was Never mind that, I'm back I'm sending you this little audio hug And hope that you smile for getting the stress That piles from all the above The more that we hurt, the harder we love As soon as it's gone, we gotta re-up It's just like a drug If people knew half of the pressure They know that it's hard to be her I'm sending you Suzanne, Ari, my love Y'all holding us down, y'all holding the crowns You ever need something from me No hesitate, please Just hit me and I'll be around, I'm gone
I need to go. We got a whole, she got the whole big old, she had to get a box. Period. Okay. okay. We got some stuff. I'll probably do my haul when I get home, y'all, but it's going down. We have to get up out of there, though, because stinks start acting <laughs> a fool. Why do kids always got to act a fool? But I blame myself because I didn't bring my stroller. I didn't have no stroller. What, what is wrong with you? You think it's so serious, scary? But I just got back from vacation, you guys, so my car's not really equipped the way it's supposed to be equipped because I'm still getting my life together, okay? Period. But... Overall, like, I got a lot of little stuff. Oh, it's 600 pieces. Let me look at my receipt again because I spent too goddamn much every oh, time. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah. That made a $15 difference. $20, it's $25 the, it's the in tax. It's tax. $20 in tax. Yeah, no, mine was $25 today. You spent $200? I spent $260. We just gave these people. Like, yeah. You see how they had all that storage? That storage is huge. They could definitely be taking clients in that moment. Dip a couple different licenses and stuff, but it all, it all happened. They had all that storage in the back. You know, they're selling all the things and everything. That's what I didn't get. Too much for them nippers. I showed me, but I got it clippers, bro. I didn't get no nippers, but I got some clippers. Where's my clippers? If you start charging me for them, I don't see them. Oh, wait, you put them in the box. Yeah, I got some nail clippers and I got a drill bit, of okay. course. So. Oh, yeah, I have straight ones too. This was $12, though. I don't like how bits are so expensive. I was like, gonna look at this, one. but I was like, cause I was looking for a coarse one for like when you know to file down all the acrylic and stuff. Oh, I definitely want to take these. I like this nippers one's back. Good. How much were they? $26.50. For the nippers? Wow. Hell no. Nippers should be like $8. Are you gonna do that? You mind? I don't mind. She might go take the nippers back. Yeah, that's why I was. That's why when Stink started running around, I said this is the wrong time he running around. I'm trying to make sure he's not double charging me. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I Twelve dollar difference. She was like, "You want cuticle nippers or acrylic nippers? You got acrylic nippers." I said, "Girl, I want cuticle." She tried to get you. She, she tried to get you. That's why I say you gotta be careful. Gotta watch. She tried to get you right there. Oh, like they got some money. They come in here. No, I'm watching everything. So. Don't just try to charge me. Like, okay, but these jumbo zebra nail files, which is the car lash ones, are $18.99 for a 50 piece. These were $22.50. I'm paying for convenience because they're right here. You are I'm, paying for convenience because they're not you know here. You're going right. to be taxing that. Right. We're going to put taxes. But, on. like, yeah, so these are $2, 2.2 .2 each. But I'm trying to see how much it is on Amazon versus in the nail supply store. Mm -hmm. about, about cool. Like, I'm paying for convenience. Like I said, I pulled up right here. I pulled up to the spot, got what I needed, and I can go right to the client. I ain't waiting on Amazon order. But for next time, though. Yeah, for next time. But I love, it's the experience, though, too, y'all. Going up in the nail supply. Ain't nothing like going up in the nail supply. You're going to let me charge your ex on you. Oh, yeah, for sure. We can do it, girl. Right. And does your sister have different tips, or she only got the square ones, too? Um, she's got a, a couple. She's got a couple of them boxes over there. My sister's got it going on. Let me. Yeah, yeah, my sister came over and see what it's doing. I ain't got her. Come on. I'm so excited. <laughs> <laughs> I already know how it is going to the nail supply store. It's like being in heaven. Like, girl, this is the motherfucking candy shop of the century. <laughs> okay, it's an adult candy shop. <laughs> girl, it really is. Like, what? They're gonna be mad at school. Hey, bitch, I just got some new shit. What you getting? <laughs> what, what you buying this weekend? No, but what? Why did So, <laughs> here's the nail haul. No. So, yeah. It's my bag of goodies. And I'm gonna show you guys what I got. Um, I feel like for this video too, I kind of do want to like show you guys over here. So you might see it pop up. Look at my beautiful picture. I got that from Tarjay, y'all. It was on clearance for $4.50. I was like, okay, yes, gotta support. So I'm gonna go through what I got from the nail supply store. So the nail supply store I went to was called. Seattle Beauty Spa Nail Supply, I believe. Um, I'll link the little thing up here. And um, yeah, so first thing first, I got me a new brush, y'all. Now, y'all know nail text, we, we gotta have some brushes. And like, I have two, technically one, because one's my sister's, I took it from her. But I have two, a size like 10, 
and I think that's a size 12 cleansing brush. I don't know where she got that from. And then I also do have a size 12 from Zule, but it, it works like a size 10 kind of. But I went ahead and got me a size, um, get out of the way. I went ahead and got me a size 10 brush. I mean, sorry, 12. Size 12. Uh, what does this say? Kalinsky German size 12. And they did crimp it for me. Okay, it wasn't crimp. This looks so y'all. And look, the what's it? The base of it is like so nice. Look at all that oil they put. They crimped my brush. They did a beautiful job. Okay. And so this is the brush that I did get from them. Um, it was like $44.50. I think I just put the prices on the side or something too. But yeah, so this is my receipt of all the stuff I got. And that's how much I spent. Okay. Um, and then I got some nail glue dryer. So, of course, this is great for drying, um, what's it called? Like regular polish and for your gems. Now, I know I did say, I think I said in the beginning of this video, I don't use gems like that and I don't, but I'm trying to implement more and I do have some clients that do like it. So I got the nail glue, extra dry spray, and that cost me glue dryer $7.50. Oh, that's not bad, $7.50. And then I got me a new dust brush, okay? A duster brush because my other one is like old and raggedy now and this is a dust brush this was only 550 525 Boom. so it's just like oh it's kind of right i gotta kind of bunk it out but yeah this is just like a dust brush you know clean up all your dust your area and everything so this dust brush 550 of course they have really nice and cuter ones and stuff on the amazon but you know you can't beat the nail supply store you know what i'm saying like it's convenience you're getting and paying for it and i needed it today i didn't need it tomorrow or whatever or whatever so we're just fresh i got my files <laughs> like i said this is what i was in the car so i got a brick of 50 nail files these are the 88 grit so that's the see, seattle nail supply 88 grit these were 22 50 um i got a couple of polishes now <laughs> i know summer is over but um i realized i have like a lot of dnd &D nail polish collection like the majority of it but there are some that i don't have right so and i realized this past summer i didn't have a lot of yellow collection and i have some clients that really 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 like yellow collection right so i went ahead and got a couple dnd polishes so i got this dnd polish which is honey honey 745 um and these were six dollars each that's not bad and then i got melty sunshine which i think is so cool this is melty sunshine Okay, and I got a Juice Lemon, number 424. The other one was Melty Sunshine is 783, and then Juice Lemon, Lemon Juice, which is 424. And this is super freaking pretty, super pretty. And then they helped me out. They put some stuff in a box for me, which is dope. Of course, I got our good old girl, Cupa. I got some Cupa top gel coat because my other one is like going out or at least I have less of yeah I don't have as much this was only um the Cupa was only like 750 yeah 750 750 and then I got some also I got one of my favorite gel top coats where is this at I don't think, did he charge me for this? Yeah, he did. These were $7.52. So I got some Gelexer, which is you can actually get from their local no uh, beauty supply store. I feel like this is the best top coat. So I got two of these for $7.50 because I need more top coat and I didn't have a lot of top coat, right? No wipe. And um, 
I this is a new I haven't bought this in a couple years low-key and um this is a different bottle than what I had before when I first bought it but same brand whatever and I promise you guys I feel like this is the best now these are the same price as the Cupa Cupa has a beautiful shine but I'm gonna see the difference in this versus the other now they did have that Cupa like the big bottle Cupa where you can just refill the Cupa bottle so I don't gotta keep buying this I didn't ask how much it was because my son started acting cranky in the store but i'm pretty sure next time i'm gonna invest into that bottle instead i've just been trying to wait to like i finished nail tech school i feel like and i'm taking clients more full time again to invest in something like that because that's something i feel like is an investment to make when you're continuously having clients um and i don't want to spend like it's probably like 30 bucks or something. i don't want to spend that type of money today and i got two nail clippers like i kind of showed you on the car but i got two straight edge nail clippers okay these are like straight edge nail clippers those were three dollars each and then i got them um, i got a coarse drill bit a 2xc 2x coarse drill bit and it's a um rounded size because i've been in the class you know and i have been learning about how the coarse drill bits are a lot better to use for like soak offs and drilling down the acrylic enhancement, you know, on the nail. So I went ahead and invested into one of these drill bits just to check it out and see how it works. This drill bit was $12. I feel like drill bits are really overpriced, but, you know, hopefully it works long term for me, right? Um, and then, y'all, I got some glitter. This is LNS. I don't it's just like a glitter like glitters are just glitters but these glitters were five dollars right yeah five dollars so I got four glitters I got this pretty like goldish looking glitter okay and then I got a purple I just got some that I feel like some of my clients have asked for that I feel like I know I would use and it is like fall and um it's fall and what's it called going into christmas season and all that holiday season and i got this red for the red girlies okay because i do want to do some like real i want to do some red like pretty red french tip like nails and do like some what's it called gems and stuff i feel like i'm gonna get that for my nails pretty soon and then i got like this black glittery like let me try to open this one yeah i oh it's closed off so i know it's having been open my son opened the gold one and didn't have this on it because he sure was getting into it i like how they have like this top protectant on here so you know it's been sealed and not open. oh you know glitter so messy y'all so this is the glitter y'all can kind of see it oh yeah let me get my life together <laughs> i'll show you guys okay i'll open and show it on the side whatever that's the black glitter we're making a mess and spilling product like a little could be a lot i don't like that and glitter is so messy and it went on my other stuff i haven't even showed yet so yeah well yeah there's the glitter yeah oh god it's so messy anyways so I got those four glitters, okay? I'm not even gonna lie, y'all. I like this, this nail brush right here already. I'm, I'm loving it already, okay? It's doing what it's supposed to do. So, the last three items I got outside of that is your girl invested into some nail polish. Now, I didn't get any like core colors or nothing like that. But I did get a couple, uh, some not polished to try out. It's my first time getting not polished, you guys, okay? Um, and I feel like I wanted to get some more, but I wanted to get just a little bit of some, some, and just try a couple things and just, plus I did just go to Dynamic Nail Supply in um, Houston. So I got some other stuff and I don't want to just double up on a whole bunch of core powders and this and that although i do want to try different brands so i just kind of want to implement a little bit of everything that i kind of needed to help my supply chain to be better um what's it called uh so these were 13 dollars each these were 13 dollars each um and i got a 
number cream burlay m121 and this is like a nice like nudie looking okay the seal was almost off but it's like a cute nudie pink looking with a little glitter in it and it's so cute i feel like for girls who may want like a pinky color or even like a ombre but it has a little glitter touch in it or maybe they want like a full nut with a little glitter you know and then put a french tip on top of it and make it even cuter i also got this lemon drop m66 which is also a nudie looking um, with some glitter in it now this still is a little damaged oh this one is so pretty oh my god i feel like i must have heard this before lemon drop um this is way prettier than this one i feel like i could have left this one at the stove i feel like i want to take this one back the cream berlay 121 but i'll just keep it they're very similar so if one runs out then the other oh my god they're so very similar they're they're not very different at all but this is what i was looking for with some glittery like nudish pinky pop uh what's called powder um i just can't wait to swatch this stuff and then the last one i got is white no what put this for it's just white i just yeah this one's actually sealed it had a double seal this is sealed seal these other ones have probably been kind of open before that's why I don't like taking ones at the front. And I probably should have opened it and looked at it first before I bought it. I just can't believe I didn't have my stroller with me first thing, right? Because he was trying to act a fool. So, yeah, I just got white and then not polished because I heard that this white works really good for, like, um, French tip or, like, pink and white and things like that. Um, so, I'm going to try that out eventually, too. So, yeah, that's everything I got from that supply store, you guys. Overall, like I said, I spent $217, basically. Now, off topic, I did also go to, what's it called? The uh, Dollar Tree recently. Because there's a Dollar Tree next door to my freaking nails, uh, what's called school. Y'all, can y'all believe that? There's literally a Dollar Tree. Like, that is a blessing and a curse at the same time. Like, it's a blessing because I can always go get some snacks when it's, like, our lunchtime and stuff or get something to drink or maybe grab something that I may need to use at the time to do nails and stuff or maybe that I need for my household, anything. But it's a curse because I'll be up in there all the time. Y'all, that little $1, $1.25 be adding up all the time. But I got this cute little case there where it's really cute. It's an organized case. But I thought this was cool for me to put, like, um some of my um what's it called nail not the nail bits the drill bits the brown ones in these cases or like it fits like polishes like say if i'm going to travel or something or i just want to bring something light somewhere it holds like polishes like a top coat things like that like in here of course you can put like charms or if i have extra like nail drill bits anything i feel like this is what i wanted to use for but i really feel like i wanted to use this to organize more of my um they're just in like little baggies like this and i just think this is so ugly and my nail dust doesn't have like drawers i don't have a nail dust with like drawers yet um and i do want to get another tier like you know the like 10 drawer tier like thing to kind of organize more of my stuff you know of course with like little caddies and things like that but i don't have that right now so i feel like for now i feel like having this and just kind of implementing this on my desk or somewhere like on top of something to be like more organized would really help me with my sanding bands. That's what they're called, sanding bands. Let me put the top of these acrylics before I damage them and I'm gonna be mad, $13 for an acrylic powder, y'all. I was spending $6 at Dynamic. Ain't nothing wrong with that. We buy what we want, what we need and that's quality. That just means the price is going up. Okay, so yeah. Then I feel like I just rambled. <laughs> also, I got my the, this Fresh Start 2024 planner for the new year. And this is so cute, y'all. Look at it inside. They got like stickers. It got stickers. And then, of course, you put like your personal information. And then it has section for notes and like the calendar and stuff i really like this i thought it was really cute and groovy with the colors and everything oh they got more like 
white stickers in the back so i can like make something in the tabs or something white stickers in the back i thought this was really cute y'all okay for only a dollar 25 to kind of just put maybe like you know notes and stuff for my business and clients then they had this monthly weekly planner for 2023 and this is really what i wanted was a weekly planner right this does just look, look really basic and flimsy and it's cheap a dollar 25 i don't care so dollar 25 it was convenient i needed it it was there um and so of course same thing you can put personal and like this is a weekly monthly planner so of course this has the months and one i'll probably use for like clients and appointments the other ones i'll probably use to like organize my finances and then it also has like the weekly and i love this because i want to be able to start planning out my to-do list and schedule i feel like weekly more coming into the new year like i definitely do it now but having something written in front of me over just in my phone and i can see it vividly in front of me it, i feel like it will help me to become more organized and successful coming into this new year so i have the week and i have the monthly in this one so this is going to be my pride gold and butter i feel like coming into this new year and i think it's very important and i've also realized that like i feel like i have big dreams big goals which are amazing but when i supplement them into taking it day by day and having a week planned out i realize i get a lot more accomplished so when i can see my week ahead and i plan for the week with my nine to five and with my business together i'm a lot more successful it's a lot more easier for me to even maneuver my week you know when i just i i gotta tell myself just take it one day at a time especially when you're dealing with so much like anxiety and stuff and you're just over always feeling pressured because you feel like you have so much to do and that's fine but when you organize it and you just look at it and you you know you you have big plans but you just make it a little bit smaller and smaller and organize it and get these planners and stuff and see what you need to do and you just follow your list it makes everything so much easier it takes all that anxiety away it takes all that unnecessary stress away all you need to do is focus on the day and do as much as you can you got five things to do you get at least three of it done that's great now where can you implement those other two things through the week and add it in or something or subtract it or maybe they just they just didn't get done they didn't just align for you at that time within the universe you know so i'm so happy i am best into this I feel like i can't breathe i'm just talking fast i'm not talking fast you listen to slow you know what i mean <laughs> Um, I'm congested. That's really what it is, y'all. My congestion. These not polishers are so pretty. I just love looking at this red, y'all. Ooh. Oh no, y'all. Now I didn't get no monomer. I wanted monomer. They didn't have any. I really wanted some young nails monomers, and I didn't see none. So that's okay i'm just gonna order the young nails monomer and that's it y'all so i really hope you guys enjoyed this haul with me and you guys got to meet my um friend my one of my nail besties mimi she's actually um we met in nail school tech school right now and we've been like best of buds ever since she's an amazing person amazing soul um and it's great to have friends it's great to have friends and accountability partners and people that can you know you can work with um when it comes to doing nails and things like that and like trading services and doing everything that you need to do it's like very very important to have um a partner or just friends or you know people here to support you or people here who want to do what you like to do and can be there for you like there's nothing wrong you know like god says you know you have one you make a lot happen you have two you can move mountains so you know that's that all right y'all that's it i'm out of here nothing else to say i really hope you guys enjoyed my nail haul please make sure you guys go ahead and subscribe subscribe to your girl subscribe like why am i still under 100 after i post this drop this video if i don't have more than 100 subscribers y'all i'm gonna be feeling some type of way like can we get me to a thousand so i can be live and i can get monetized y'all like come on i'm bringing the deets i'm bringing the deets <laughs> And as soon as I get my new um, recording stand, you guys, I will start recording myself doing acrylic nails. Um, it's just been a little busy for me. I am working full time and going to school full time and then raising my son. So I'm working on implementing it, but I really love that you guys have been enjoying my shorts. My shorts have been doing great. I love the numbers, analytics on my shorts. So subscribe to your girl, Queen L Nails, and much love to you guys. And I'll see you next time. Bye.
Ooh, my nose is running. Working on the weekend like usual. Way off in the D.